Hey everybody, welcome back to Ghost of Tsushima. Uh, we're gonna head over to, uh, well eventually, we're gonna head down here to start the Tale of Lady Masako. On the way though, we're gonna stop by this village. There's something that uh, came up when we were there last time. Some type of training is available. The Hayoshi Bamboo Strike. And then also we'll check out this undiscovered location behind it. And hopefully that'll all make sense. I gotta say, early impressions, like, I am really, really impressed. This game is, like, incredible. Which way is this taking us here? We'll go around. Just, like, from the art design to the cinematography to the gameplay itself, I already like the characters. Uh, Sassy Kawa that we met is like <laughs> so just like no holds bars. No holds. What is it? No. No holds bar. No holds barred. <laughs> I don't know what it is. You know what I mean? He just doesn't hold Golden back, bird. okay? Some say they know Ooh. every secret on this island. I wonder where it's going. Every secret on this island. We saw a fox earlier. Where'd the bird go? He's down below us. Oh. We'll follow him. Now, at the beginning, it was something about um, our father being kind of the wind and our mother being the birds, I think. That's kind of a cool way of tying this all together. Hey, what are you trying to show me? Oh, it's like... <laughs> is this the thing we were heading towards? Oh my god. Cool. Okay. So what was this that he was asking us to do? That's so funny. Uh... L1XX. What does this mean? We just hit it in order? You're too slow to cut through two bamboo. Oh, cool. Whoa. L1XX, L1 triangle. Not bad. <laughs> this is like some Parappa the Rapper stuff. Resolve has increased. Okay. Okay, so we want to keep our eye out for those. Very nice. We had learned of that from uh, the guy... The Sakai Steel is a truly fine blade. From this guy. Wielded by an even finer swordsman. But training with bamboo will only make you stronger. I'll need strength for what lies ahead. There are bamboo stands throughout the island. They will help sharpen your skills on the journey. Farewell, my lord. Yeah, because when we came to this island originally, he was like, oh, we should go train. And I guess that's what he was here for. Uh, but then the bird led us here anyway, so very nice. Let's go to this point in the island to see what's there. And then we're going to go to the tale of Lady Masako. Nobu. Nice. Other merchants here. We have at least a couple of settlements. Oh, we're pulsing. There it is. I not learn the good writing, but some must writing down songs of the Biwa Hoshi. Very good stories. But he killed by invaders, then no more stories, forgetted by all. Long ago, there was bow using man. He saved the town. Also, another bow using man who killed the demons. And the man who is very fast with katana swings. So many others. Write more tomorrow. Now go deliver supplies to Jade Hill's camp. Oh, cool. Why use more words? 
when few words do trick. <laughs> is, that what, is that what it is? You'll get through this. Okay. I don't know if this is horse traversal worthy. We're going it alone here. So far, at least, it's got a really cool sense of um, discovery as well. And, like, you're rewarded for going off the beaten path a little bit. Something down here. So this must be one of those uh, fox shrines, but I found it without the fox. Nari shrines. Okay. I'll take it. Whoa, whoa, whoa! It's like locking us into the shrine for some reason. Just seeing if we could see where the fox comes from. There's something across the way there too, but another bird. Holy smokes. Take me where you want. I'm all yours. Oh, he's taking me to the uh, the location. I imagine there's going to be a fair amount of um, overlapping like that. Of objectives. This is just good. Pillar of Honors. Uh, weapons? Yasha's embers, beware the warrior's fiery vengeance. That's got to be a weapon, right? Katana. Yasha's embers. Oh, we'll switch. Now, is this strictly... I think this is strictly cosmetic. You can even mix and match your short swords if you want. Let's see. Oh no, you're switching the sword kit itself. Okay. Oh yeah, very nice. Very nice. Okay. Here's the fox den, I guess, that we completed before we saw the fox. Let's head out of here now. And like, everything feels really organic. It's quite clear they put a lot of work into... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell? <laughs> Standoff? I don't know about that. Want to fight all these guys? Okay. <laughs> Show me your skill. This is going to go poorly. There's so many. samurai. <laughs> Oh yeah, the kunai. I knew that was going to happen. Damn it. Ouch! Okay, these guys are like significantly more challenging than anything else we've dealt with. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay, we got him. We got him. That was something. <laughs> Whatever you did there, Nobu, good job. Good job, little Nobu. It's pretty likely we'll find something along the way here, but... I guess we probably should take those opportunities to build up our renown a little bit. There you go. I'm not going to ask how you got down here, but... Golden Forest. I'd say so. Another bird. What the hell? How am I going to see the bird in here? <laughs> Incident at Hayoshi Pass. I heard shouting near the bridge. I should make sure no one is hurt. Okay, so the bird's still leading us somewhere else, They've I think. They've taken the bridge. Tell me. We were running for Hiyoshi Springs. The bridge looked safe, but the Mongols were in the ravine. They, they, they started shooting from below. Someone's injured. Banta. My brother's boy. I'll look for him. him is bit. Tell your family to stay clear of the bridge. I'll stop this. You're about to start a new tale. Are you sure you want to proceed? Progress in your current tale will be saved. Yes. Keep screaming, run. Your Rescue Banta from the Mongol archers. Should I be just heading out to the bridge here? Feels risky. Enemies. Yeah, okay. So we have to drop down like they were talking about. I see him. I see him. Whoa! Oh, no way. I didn't even mean for that to happen. Wait, what happened? Whoa! Only cowards strike from the shadows. Come on, Uncle. Uncle. Like every time. Okay, we can do drop assassinations like this. Nice. Any more behind me? I think we're clear. Oh, so risky. Oh, we can submerge too. This is insane. Fighting in these rocks. I'll 
Can I not reach this? I guess not. Where is this coming from? Oh, they're way over here. There's two more out there. Nice, we have a count even. Rizzy. Oh, I see him. Did the bees help? Too far. Nice. Now that's cool. I see him. They didn't have to back up. Sleep. <laughs> wow. That is wild. Here, my lord. The bridge is clear. Speak with Banta's uncle. Banta's safe and sound. You guys should leave. The Mongols are gone. Did they scream? Their suffering isn't your concern. Take your family to Hiyoshi Springs. These roads are dangerous. We will. Thank you. That was like our first real side quest that wasn't focused on like a bird <laughs> or a fox. Uh, but it kind of was. The bird did lead us here, but to see it kind of evolve into something bigger, that's really nice. We have a charm. Defense charm. Is there any armor to upgrade? Okay, so we have enough to upgrade our traveler's attire. So traveling clears 20% more fog of war on the map. That's fine. Let's look at the charm situation. Armor of Unyielding. Moderately reduces damage taken while at 50% health or less. Sadly, that will probably come into play a decent amount. Do we see these charms on us somewhere? Okay, good luck, guys. You're a good horse, noble. Something over here, too. guys are like sparring okay defeat the mongols bonus kill enemies undetected without without focus hearing and find and observe the mongol leader hmm. 
don't want to do a standoff. Observe leader. There we go. So this is like another way of... If we don't want to engage, we can still use this to progress towards um, other unlocks. That's sick. Okay. So we have our first... Well, I guess technically our second stance. Water stance is highly effective against shields. So how do we even switch between these? Heavy attacks deal extra stagger damage. So there's some combos as well. Stone stance, sword breaker. And then we have shield breaker. Or if we hold it and then tap, we do a flurry strike. Oh, hold alt R2 to change stances. Oh, sick. We have artifacts. I wonder if I can um, kill him like one shot. Who sees me here? I don't quite understand who's seeing me. If I take this guy out, I feel like they're all going to get me. Oh, okay. Nice. Oh, so you can actually do both. If you do the observe first, you still you get credit for the kill as well. A little unfortunate. I'm gonna see if there's a way to kind of reset their aggro here. Uh, yes, there is. I'm trying not to use that focused hearing, but I don't know if that means I can't use it at all or if I just can't kill them while it's active. There's an artifact. These guys are going to see me. Maybe not. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. Okay, and then it removes the uh, undetected. I kind of want to see what the bonus gives us. Let's see if we can run away for a bit here. I know I'm kind of manipulating things a bit, but I just want to learn how all the mechanics actually work. Ooh. We might... <laughs> we might have to just... Uh... Oh, looks like they kind of refreshed the objective. I don't have any arrows. Okay, I think we're fighting this. Whoa. It's really difficult to fight in there. Water is good for shields, right? So if there are none. Oh, 
Oh, look at that. Those work so well. Okay. I'm guessing with the bonus, we probably just get more of that built up. Need to find a swordsmith for sure. That's really slick. Let's see. What is the other uh, combo that we had? Equip charms. Yeah, we've done that. Well, stance is here. Hold triangle, then double tap triangle. Okay. Cool. Works for me. We should actually try to clear out the uh, camp here. I actually really appreciate that everything kind of uh, has that sheen on it that you can pick up from a distance. So in the future, we definitely want to be... Oh, whoa, cool. We definitely want to be observing leaders when possible. And then killing. There's also an artifact nearby here still. Is it on him? Nope. Ah. Singing crickets. What is that? Crickets are a symbol of autumn and an inspiration for many poems and lyrical works. Prized for their singing, they're often caught and kept in small cages. They can be found everywhere in nature, though some say it's best to look in cemeteries where they sing to comfort the dead. Singing crickets needed to learn a new flute melody. Okay, and then that leads to changing up the... Um, changing up the... weather. So... The Adak tree, a structure deeply rooted in traditional Mongolian folk religion or shamanism. Mongolian shamanism is affiliated with all aspects of the culture, including medicine, religion, and application for nature and ancestral worship. Very nice. Okay. On the road again. You guys probably noticed too, but there are definitely some frame rate uh, things that happen. And I'm wondering if I go into here switch to better frame rate oh yeah like even with the rain you can immediately tell that's probably the way to go we make a good team we do make a good team we're kicking ass actually nice hey. Oh, what's this now? They're running. Wait, who's... Okay, then. Nobody hits the horse. Trying to see if I can... Perfect parry. Oh my god! <laughs> what the... A little late. Okay, so you gotta really be, like, delayed. Whoa! Did this boar just kill us? We just got boar killed. We just got killed by a boar. A raging hormonal boar. At least it's not a big set. <laughs> wow. Now we know the devastation that is possible. And it's like everything is just straight orange. You guys want to tussle? I'll tussle. Oh. 
Whoa. There it is. Hustle complete. It's like a camp here? Are we like I can't tell if we're in if we're hostile here, I think so. Oh yeah, we are. Oh boy. I was trying to see if there was like a leader in the camp or something. Oh, survivor camp. Right next to this place, too. Uh, to be honest, no. I don't have anything to offer you. You, however, bow vanity gear. Moderate damage and draw speed. Undiscovered. Okay. Just letting it load to see what we're looking at here, but... I don't mind this. If you can bring more, it's yours. We're a couple off from having the patchwork straw hat. Oh. I think I'll save. Thank you for all you do. Lord Sakai, you must do something. It's Kii Sake Brewery in Azamo. That brewery is the pride of Tsushima. I remember the first time I tried Kii Sake. Soon there will be none left. The Mongols are taking it by force. I'll see what I can do. Here we go. He's pawned. The Mongols are attacking the Ki Sake Brewery in Azamo, a favorite of mine in all of Tsushima. I won't let them drain it dry. <laughs> okay. That's uh, a little bit further south even, so we're actually quite close. There's also something out here it looked like. Another fox. I got you, buddy. Let's roll. What do you got for me? Nice. Thanks, buddy. Oh, I have a bad feeling about those smokestacks. Oh, you can pet it! No way. That's outstanding. He's so pumped, too. Almost there. <laughs> I 
Nine arrows just randomly. So there's got to be a way. There's got to be a way to get these hides, right? Maybe we need some type of special... Maybe we need, like, a special knife or something? Because we've taken a couple down, but... I don't have the ability to get anything off of them. What is that noise? Look at this. Holy. Okay, we're basically here. Adachi Estate. Let's be cool. Mongol Empire is invading our home. They are brutal. Relentless. Unstoppable. 